Hey, it's Jackie with Salutio. In this video, I'm going to go over how to add a sign up form to where you can collect additional subscribers through your website. Let's click on sign up for in the audience tab, and then I'm going to click on sign up forms here. So we can either um, use something that's already pre created, build. If you want to pop up, you can add it that way, or I think what we want to do is the embedded forms option. We'll click on that one. And here is this, what this looks like. And so if you want to change the time, show only required fields. Oh, okay. I wonder if you can take off the birth date one. But here's the, the HTML we'll have there. Oh, so here are some different options. Condensed, subscribe. Oh, so we either want the classic, the condensed, or the horizontal. I'm going to go with the horizontal one and I'm going to go ahead and copy this. And then on the website, I'm going to put this in as the bulletin description is where I'm going to put this. That way it's above the bulletin on the bulletin page. So let's go to the document categories, click on bulletin. And kind of like anytime we're pasting HTML, we're going to click on the source code and paste it in right there. Click OK. So here's the MailChimp subscribe to our bulletin widget. I'm going to save and close that. It might not yet be so showing up on the website. That's OK. There's one more setting we'll have to check out. On that, it's going to be on the main menu. We're going to find a bulletin right here. And under the Docman area, oops, details, show, category, description. We're going to set that to yes. And then we would look at the bulletin here. Whoops, it hadn't finished saving. There it is. So we can, um, that almost looks like the classic. So this is the horizontal one. I'll go back to that description and see if there's anything, or the category description and see if there's anything we can do different. Um, Cause I thought this was supposed to be above the field and the subscribe was to be the, to the right. At least that's what it looked like in here. If you're not familiar with HTML, you might not spend your time with this. Um, I'm just looking to see if there's any widths. So this is absolute position left. Subscribe. So I'm just going to remove the style out of that div. I would not remove an ID, but I'm going to remove that style and save and see what happens. And if it looks messed up, like it kind of does here, I'm just going to go back to, um, and grab the original. the original um, embed code. Clear this out, paste the new one in. Refresh. Whoops. Okay, I'm gonna look at that one more time because we've got some extra paragraph tags again.
put email kind of fun. Click OK. Save and close. And there it is. And again, because this isn't actually St. Peter's MailChimp account, I'm going to go ahead and remove that from the bulletin description so it doesn't stay there. Otherwise, that is those are the steps to um, have your bulletin subscription added to the website.